The brown and purple lines resume normal operations today, but some riders say they are not ready to move on. They want more answers after their brown line train was stopped for hours on a bridge over the Chicago River. CBS 2 Sarah Maki went looking for answers. Sarah, what did you find out? Well, Jim Marie, the CTA said that according to preliminary information, they had a ground fault, explaining to think of it like a circuit breaker being tripped in your home. Today, when we came back out, you could see two CTA workers walking the entire length of the bridge over the Chicago River, where this all happened during the Tuesday afternoon rush hour. A CTA spokesperson said their workers couldn't do any investigations or repairs until the customers and the trains were safely removed from the area. And that took hours on Tuesday evening with dramatic video of riders being helped off the train and walking single file along a catwalk to safety. Some riders say they felt this might be more than just a power problem, but transportation experts say it's unlikely the train wheel and track ever lost contact. And it felt like the train was like off the tracks on the right side. It leaned up on the left, slammed back down, giant spark or explosion, I don't know. And then came to a halt and then we were stuck there for like two hours. The way trains are designed, there's the gra center of gravity is so low that the risk of a train like toppling over is just, that's just not gonna happen easily. CTA authorities say that they are still trying to figure out exactly what caused that ground fault. However, they do say that they've checked all the speed already and they say that the speed was not a factor. Live in the loop tonight, Sarah Maki, CBS 2 News. Sarah, thank you.